When you first receive the Edge EG5 noise dosimeter shipment, confirm you have received everything you ordered. You should have the correct number of units, single or five station edge dock with adapter, instruction manual, quick start instructions, DMS software CD, download cable, calibration certificate, and calibrator if ordered. Although all units are calibrated prior to shipment, we strongly recommend you pre-calibrate each unit before using. To pre-calibrate, remove the windscreen by unscrewing. Ensure the unit is on and stopped with no run arrow. Turn on the calibrator. Be sure the adapter ring is inserted into the calibrator. Slide the edge microphone into the mouth of the calibrator. CAL will flash on the display. Press the on-off enter button to trigger the calibration display. To adjust the calibration value on the display, repeatedly press the up or down arrow. When you reach the appropriate decibel level of 114, press the on-off enter key. A shaded bar will appear when loading your calibration information. Then a summary screen will indicate the date and time. To return to measurement screen, press on-off enter key. Battery life will be displayed at the top right of the display screen with the battery icon and hours and minutes left. If battery life is less than the amount of time you need to survey, recharge the battery fully by sliding the unit downward onto the hook of the edge dock. Plug the adapter into the dock and then plug it into the power supply. When the dosimeter is docked, the top LED indicator on the base will be illuminated. A red flashing LED indicates it is charging. A green solid LED indicates a fully charged battery. To start the survey, once the dosimeter is turned on, press and hold the run stop key. A three, two, one countdown will appear. Then run indicator will appear at the top right of the display. Also, the LED indicator will flash green. Clip the unit on the shoulder of the worker. Perform a post calibration before downloading any data. This gives you a post calibration time and date stamp for your report. Set this up the same way as the pre calibration. The instrument recognizes that this is a post calibration for this survey. You will be able to make adjustments, but you should not on your post calibration reading. The post calibration should be within a few tenths of a decibel of the pre calibration. Data can be downloaded and a report printed by Galson or by you. If you want Galson to do this, just repack everything and send back with instructions for us to download the data for you. To download the data yourself, first install the latest version of DMS software provided. Dock the dosimeter on the edge dock and turn on the dosimeter by pressing the on-off enter key. Plug the USB cable into your computer and plug the opposite end into the docking station. The docking station will be powered through the computer. Thus, you do not need to plug in the charger adapter. For first time use of a docking station, welcome to the found new hardware wizard will appear. Select no and press next through the remaining wizard. At the end of the wizard, press finish. This will install the hardware components associated with the edge dock. Note, if you have more than one edge dock, this wizard will appear for each new dock which is connected to your computer. In the DMS start screen, choose Download. Select Edge 5 from the left side. If downloading using single edge dock, select the unit to download by checking the box. Click box Go to Data Finder after download. Then click Download button. Box will appear that download was successful. <laughs> click Yes or No to erase instrument data. To view the data and customize reports, Refer to pages 39 and 40 in the manual provided. Exit from software, remove cables and CD, and repack everything to be shipped back to the lab. Questions? Contact SGS Galson by phone or IH Live Chat, 303-566-7000.